Either way, you're a dead man. Alright. Oh shit! I think I killed Bill. I shot Bill right through the damn chest. Alright, Michael, what you want? <clears throat> you in my tent? Michael? Blessed are the peacemakers. The peacemakers. Shall be called... Hey, Molly, where's Dutch? Well, however it goes. I'm not sure all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Now, that's because, Cowpoke, you are a man of profoundly Cowpoke. limited intelligence. No doubt. Well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around, digging us ever deeper into shit. Old Mr. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Pearson! Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch, you tell him, fat man. It's peace, Dutch. Just tell him, fat man. And Driscoll's. I mean, <clears throat> I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple of the Driscoll boys on the road in the town. Things were about to get ugly, but you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tiger. I bet. <laughs> anyway, somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things. Parlay? Like gentlemen. Gentlemen. Yeah. Cone <clears throat> O'Driscoll. <clears throat> Have you lost your minds? They're always telling us, Dutch. Do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parlay? It's a trap. Well, of course, it's probably a trap. But what do we got to lose finding <clears throat> out? Get shot. We ain't getting shot because you'll be protecting us. It's a trap. You shoot a lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that slim chance. I don't see the point hmm. in any of this. I don't know about this. It's a chance. We've gotta take. I killed Combs' brother. Long time ago. Then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. Mm -hmm. As you say, it's a long time ago, Dutch. Let's go. You and me, with Arthur protecting us, no one else. What about me? This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. Excuse me. Uh, I don't know about this. Fine. Mount up <clears throat> then, Morgan. Get up. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, Michael. Let's go then. <clears throat> I've been fighting Combs for so long now, I can barely remember a time when it was different. And you're still fighting him now. Make no mistake of that. Here he goes, Doubting Thomas. Doubting Is there Thomas. Any plan you ain't sour on? Oh, uh, maybe you're right. Dear. I'm just nervous. Let's not waste any more lives needlessly. I ain't costing lives here. I'm saving them. What did you say? We had. Pinkertons coming after Pinkertons. us because of Blackwater and Leviticus Cornwall and his private army. Then it, who knows when this local hillbilly thing will come to a head? Hmm? Can we really afford to be fighting on all these fronts? And O'Driscoll, there is wisdom in that. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen. But like I said, I'm nervous. Look. No. He ain't even going to be the one in danger. Yeah. So get on over there and oh. find a nice perch for you to settle into. You got that rifle, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Then me and Dutch walk right into the lion's den. We 
expected you to cover us. Hmm? Okay. Just keep calm. Unless I give you a reason not to. Oh, we'll be fine. <clears throat> we got you. I will do my best. Oh, my dear and trusted friend, with you watching over me, I would walk into hell itself. Ooh. As would I. Hey, up there. Men on the ridge. Oh, Driscoll's <clears throat> from the look of them. I don't like having eyes on us. We're oh, the horses. You'll be the eyes soon enough. Maybe he's right, Dutch. Maybe I have pushed too hard. Got us into situations that could have been safer. I just... I see all those mouths we gotta feed, and I... I dream too big. I feel like you're talking too much. Yep. That's my problem. Rather you too. Caring too much. There's no such thing. <clears throat> this is horse shit from mm -hmm. both of you. It might be. Micah might be full of shit. He is. Como Driscoll might be full of shit. He is too. The promise of this great nation. Don't you think you are too? Men created equal. <clears throat> Liberty and justice for all that might be nonsense too but it's worth trying for it is worth believing in can't you see that friend i don't know try <laughs> all i ask is you try i don't know all right cowpoke <clears throat> you're gonna peel off up ahead We'll be meeting down on the plane. Find a spot just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right. All right. All right. All right I'm going. However this shakes out, let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. Oh, let's go. Oh! Okay there. <clears throat> well, you eat now. How's your gang doing? All right. Still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hmm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Mm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, it's a charismatic... Well, nasty ass looking hair. A lot of heat on us this time. <clears throat> Both of us. Whole heap of trouble. <clears throat> they offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. Mm. You always love the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. Ladies, man. I like that about you. <clears throat> what are we doing here? Go home. Is this thing over? Oh, damn fucker looking nose. Oh! You son of a bitch! <clears throat> Oh. <laughs> you sons of bitches! I don't know. Column's got a sense. Handing him over to the lords. I don't know. Strange times. They killed. We get away. Fuck the whole lot. Come on, Arthur. With this fella, Column's right. 
There you go. Don't shoot me. I got him. Did I kill you? Oh, not yet. <laughs> no, of course not. <clears throat> not yet. But I will. Oh. <laughs> and then I'm still alive. On the back of a horse. Finally, put his weapons over there. <clears throat> They got me locked up in the basement. <laughs> All right, uh, done. Whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> Arthur Morgan. It's good to see you. Uh, Howdy, shit, man. <laughs> How's woo? Got me strung up my underwear. I hardly feel it. You will. <laughs> Septic. Now, tell me, uh, fine gun like you, but uh, why are you uh, still my shoulder. running around with old Dutch? Could come right with me and make real money. It ain't about the money, Cole. No, no. It's Dutch's famous car. Uh, uh, Ow, you uh, bitch. You killed a whole bunch of my boys. I ain't got no clue what you're talking about. Oh, you lie, my friend. And I thought Dutch preached true. Let me go, Cohen. And end all this crap between you two. We all got real problems now. The way I see it, they get him. They forget about me. They ain't the forgetting sort. If I were you... I'd run as soon as I had the money. <laughs> oh, I know you would. Let's see. We lure an angry Dutch in to rescue you. Grab all of you. Hand you. Then disappear. Mm -hmm. So you only met with him to grab me? Of course. He's gonna be so mad. He gonna come raging over mm -hmm. here. And a whole lot <laughs> of Bastard. We're awake. You can swing the shackles to reach the metal file and can be used. Okay. Oh, Arthur. Alright, Arthur. There we go. You get some momentum now. There we go. There we go. We're free. Oh, this is not gonna feel good. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Uh. 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 Oh. Son of a bitch. All right, we're done with this. Pour some gunpowder on it. Okay. Now I'm gonna cauterize it. Uh, here we go. I'll burn my beard off. Yeah. Ah. Ah. Ah, damn it. I don't want to go to Mexico. I want to 
want to go home. Home. Hold on, I'll be back in a minute. What the hell? Hey, come here, buddy. There you go. Taking a little nap. What's he still doing down there? It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. You better hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes for that side of beef. What the hell is my throwing ass? Tons of bitches. All right, you fucking bitches. Where are they at? Get my damn guns. Where'd you go? Come on, you sons of bitches. Get in close now. Let's see. Oh, shit. Someone put it back on the hook. Damn, they about killed my ass. They're gonna get my damn guns. Leave it out of my guns. I'll take the jury, babe. And I'll take my weapons. There we go. Okay, Arthur, I gun killed everybody with their own pistols. Ah. Oh boy, let's go. First thing, I'm getting rid of this shit. All right, boys. Oh shit, you stupid bitch. is off right now. Alright. Get me back to camp. Oh, I had better days. Arthur. I had better days. Arthur. I told you it was just up to us. Oh, my boy, Touch. my dear boy, what? <clears throat> 
I got away. Yeah, yeah, you did. Miss Grimshaw, I need help. Now, where the hell my damn clothes? He's gonna set the law on Earth. Oh, of course he was. I'm sorry, Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Swanson! Mr. Morgan, Mr. Morgan, you're safe now. Oh, let's get him to bed. You are safe now, Arthur. Okay. I got you. You're safe now. Uh, that's pretty. That's, that's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. You're home. I don't look like it. Mm. Wolf. Or Cowdy? It's Cowdy. Weeks later, I thought I'd be calling back. You, Mr. Morgan, they might have got well, longer. Not quite yet, River. Good. How you feeling? Oh, uh, about the same as you. I'm sorry to hear that. <clears throat> well, take care of yourself. Yeah, I'll try. The storm coming in. All right, what are we doing today? All right, what what the hell do you want? Ah, Herr Morgan, Herr Strauss, how are you enjoying yourself here? Well enough, I guess. And you? Well, it turns out the pursuit of freedom is not a cheap business. Not for us, cheap and business. not for some of the locals. Sharking already. <laughs> I prefer to call it banking. You ain't the one handing out the beatings. No, but I am the one feeding the women and children in the camp. What choice do we have, Mr. Nah, Morgan? I don't know. Well, come on, then. Tell me who. Here's the list. Refinery worker turned hunter by the name of Vinton Holmes. Vinton You'll find him Holmes. up in the hills north of Strawberry. Ah, an apprentice undertaker. This one <clears throat> working in rows. His name was Gwen Hughes. And how many of them do you think will be able to pay? <laughs> With enough encouragement, both of them. <laughs> well. All right, let's go and me see Bill. Good boy. Shut up. <laughs> Why the hell did always give me that gun? We've been waiting for you, Arthur. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the busy healing over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job. Needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them, and they're paying. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. Mm. This seem legit to you, Bill? Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? We'll find out. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And what if they're bored in their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, that's so. Yeah, they think it was that's a lot of cow shit, right? Listen, I know Ooh, a lot of horse shit right there. Ah, don't walk in it. Oh. We're stuck in the I middle can't of move. some ancient feud. No. Instead of playing both sides, we're being oh. used by both of them. They were saying that Catherine Grace <clears throat> when they hold up. This don't feel right. Now What's happening? Feel right. I could have told you. Oh! Son of a bitch! John got fucked up! You bastard! You killed Sean! Gun up, bitches! You bobbing and weaving? You ain't about, you ain't doing shit! Oh, sorry, horse. Look at him. Of course he's dead. He got his, he got a fucking hole in his face. You sure you want to talk about this now, Morgan? 
What's that? I don't want that gun. Oh! Where'd my hat go? There it is. There we go. Oh, you sons of bitches. Fuck the wheel. How do I get down? I'm gonna blow up. Yeah. Rest in pieces. After in the gun store. I'll get the front. You take the back. Let's go. Holy shit, there's a lot of people. I'm coming, shut the hell up. You're getting sloppy, Morgan. You see that window in Sean's skull? Don't talk to me about sloppy. Better in here, not there. The damn post is in my way. Think so. Now it's sinking in. So the what damn loop? We ain't getting out of this with nothing. That's assuming we even get out. Of course, I just got done healing. This is you and me, Morgan. Ah! We always get the job done. You call this getting the job done? Where See are you that? going somewhere? Those cowards are running away. Looks like most of them. Not all of them. Sheriff Gray. And what about Bill? Where the hell's he? We'll Damn, we done later. slaughtered another town. Sheriff Gray! You need to get a hold on this town. It's going to hell. Who do you think you are? Punching two big thugs from God knows where? You're so dumb to think Sheriff. what you've been doing. Come out, Sheriff. It's over. We put down far worse than you a hundred times over. Oh, yeah? This is the Grays town. I want to hear you hiding behind a door. Always been, always will be. Only Grays I see left around here is dead. Is you. You want us to come out? We'll come out. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, Bill. Guns on the ground now. Oh, yeah? Please don't do it. You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, Chef. I'll blow his brains out. You want to join your little friend there, do you? <sighs> Damn it, Sean. That's too bad. I like Sean. Good kid. Well, how the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. <laughs> he was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out, except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what, six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Very Proper someplace quiet. Micah, best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, you pair of gum. Damn. Bodies laying in the streets. Sean has been killed. His head shot half off in an ambush. Still no Confederate gold, but a shitload of trouble.
That's a little mean as fuck walking up to there. Arthur, have you seen that boy, Jack? No. Oh. Where's my goddamn son? Where is he? Where's my son? They took him, didn't they? they my son. My son. Who took him? We think the Braithwaite woman took him. Well, oh, John. Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything, uh, where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him. We will bring him back to you, and we will kill any fool There's that John. had the temerity to touch one hair on that boy's head, Abigail. You have my word. Just get me back, my son. I will get that boy back, so help me God. Right now. Dutch! We just heard about Jack. You need some extra guns? Yeah, why not? Micah, Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill him. The rest of you, let's ride. You okay. tell him I'm coming, let's and hell is coming with me. Back. Come on, Lenny. Let's go kick some ass. Yeah, we just got shot to hell by the Greys in town. I know. Might as well fuck up the Bracewoods. I don't want to even think about that right now. <clears throat> we have to focus on Jack. How come I get stuck in the back? I swear, I'll kill everyone there. Easy, John. Try to stay calm. I'm fine. How the hell did they get to him? I don't know, but we are getting him back and they will pay. I promise you that. What about the gold? Who gives a damn about the gold? They got Jack. I hate to break it to you, but I don't think there is any gold. Or if there is, it's hidden somewhere no one knows. What? I've turned every stone. Christ's sake, Hosea. After all that, another perfect scam. We underestimated them. Mm -hmm. No, they underestimated us. Enough talk. There is no point arguing how we got here. This is where we are. And we are going to fix it. So come <clears> on. Here we come. Okay, get your heads right. Nobody makes a move until I say so. Dum 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 oh, dum 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 All right everyone dismount and come to me Get my damn guns hang on Dutch boy Okay Go in on foot from here Alright. What? Why do you keep giving me that damn gun? I don't want it. <laughs> Thank you. Now, Jack. We should have stayed out of all of this. Bit late for that, ain't it? Quiet. We're going to fix this right now. Like they don't know we're coming. Come on. <clears throat> let's get this done. John, you sure you're okay? Like I said. I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these redneck families think they can ruin us? I don't think so. There they are. Aren't right, you sons of bitches? Where's boy? the boy? I'm gonna let them fly at those sons of bitches. Don, I need you to stay calm. <clears throat> Get down here now, you inbred trash! What the hell do you want? Easy, John. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. You shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged, or otherwise, that is a young boy. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. Oh, hell no. It's on now.
Am I scared of your peoples? Oh, fuck. Oh, you lucky I can't shoot. I tried. You ain't gonna be civilized about this. There you go. You just watch him get murdered. You're next. Goodbye. 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 All right, reload. I got some slugs now, motherfuckers. Anybody in here? Jack, Jack, you in here? Can you hear me? Jack! No. Fuck that. Where are you, Jack? Oh shit! Hey! Oh. Son of a bitch. Sorry, I was killing people. Come on, John. John. The boy. Bastards. Where's the boy? We have lived in this house for a hundred and twenty years. We never had no problems except for Where Yankees. Where is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son. Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, you better. I know your Birth time. Singing. Come and scum. <clears throat> Where is the boy? You filth. All right, we get her out of here. What about them? Oh, he did. What about them? Now let's get this hag outside. Any more of her sons to deal with? No. Fucking they're all dead. Yeah. That's right. Burn this dog to the ground. You got that one, Arthur? I guess that's the 
charge of the goddamn cribbage game. <laughs> What's that? Oh, let's go. Well, actually, one more. There you go. <laughs> I never liked you. Why'd you take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite? You stole Boys my Boys are off liquor. limits. You stole my horses. Ain't no rules in war, Mr. Matthews. Yes, yes. Well, look, you lost a lot in this. Where's the boy? My sons <clears throat> gave him to Angelo Bronte. Angelo so Bronte. It's Saint Denis. Either Saint Denis. Or on my boat to Italy. Let's go. Oh, God. Arthur, come on. What are we doing with her? Leave her. I told you she was crazy. <laughs> Damn, she going back in the house? That bitch is crazy. It's gonna work out, John. It's gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. If I don't get that boy back safe, um, she, she'll kill us all. I know, but looking at this, logically, well, that boy is fine. They took him to scare us. Nobody takes a boy to harm him. He's right, John. What do you think, Arthur? The boy will be fine, but well, of course Marston scared rotten. We, we killed all those people. Mm. We stirred up all that trouble <laughs> for nothing. Not chaos. No, <clears throat> no, not for nothing. For living. Now we get that boy back, and we go. Trust me. Hey Dutch, we got a problem. Not a problem. Oh Visitors. shit. A solution. Good day, fine people. Mr. Vanderland. Mr. Matthews, I presume. And who are you? Rip Van Winkle. Uh -uh. Huh. Good day, sir. Agent Milton, Pinkerton Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Agent Milton. Ah, Mr. Morgan. Nice to see you again. And to what do we shit. owe the pleasure, Agent Moron? I don't know if you're <laughs> aware, but this... This is a civilized land now. We didn't kill all them savages only to allow the likes of you to act like human dignity and basic decency was outmoded or not yet invented. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing as civilized. It's man so in love with greed he has forgotten himself and found only appetites. And as a consequence, that lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you've led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker, Mr. Milton. You ain't much of anything more than a killer, Mr. Vanderlind. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me, and I give the rest of you three days to run off disappear and go and live like human beings someplace else you came for me risk life and limb in this den of low lives and murderers so that they might live and love <sighs> ain't that fine mm. <laughs> i don't want to kill all these folk dutch just you in that case it'll be my honor to join you <clears throat> Excuse me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with. I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. Yeah, You're yeah. making you a big mistake, face. all of you. <laughs> yeah, dreadful. We have got something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. Will be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. All of you will die. 
Run away from this place, you fools! Run! Come on. Get your damn hands off of me. Don't you boy. talk to Lenny like that. What now? We get out of here. And quick. Any ideas? I know a big old house. Hidden in the swamps outside San Denis. I'm sure they'll find us eventually, but it should buy us a few days. A few days is all we need. There's a spot out by Shady Bell. Lenny and I got into that dispute with the previous occupiers. Place is well hidden. You and Arthur, right out to make sure no one else has moved in. Lenny, you go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John, we'll get Jack back, and we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Come on, John. This is crazy. We'll get packed up, but we need a new spot off. Yep. Follow me. Come on, John. I know the way. It's gonna be all right, John. We should be going for Jack. We will. We have to move everyone first before that bastard Milton comes back with an army. We ain't no use to Jack in jail or at the end of a rope. I don't even know what to think no more. Just gotta keep our cool. Be smart about this. Be small. Are you joking? Oh, that's that's good. I guess show the smoke from the fire we started. How many people huh. we killed the past few weeks? Well, John rattle faster. It's Dutch playing his game. Hosea too. Get involved with those two families. Master Khan there, working their magic. They thought there was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always. Look, Marston, I don't know what to tell you. I like the house still smoking. That's pretty cool. Out. That ain't nothing new. Jack's gone. <clears throat> we lost Sean, Mac, Davey, Jenny. And for what? We can't change what's done. We can only move on. But one day, we need to start learning from our mistakes. Come on. It ain't all bad. We've had a rocky run, but we'll be okay. We'll get through it. Hold on. What happened? Oh! Come on. Anyway, you're I'm a John. Dutch will fix it. Dutch will come up with a big plan. Right now, every plan gets us into worse trouble. We're getting further from where we're meant to be going. All right. Should be just down this path to the left here. You can't put all this on Dutch. You worked up, and rightly so. Just don't get too far into your head with all this, or you'll never get John, out. now you keep slowing down for. Goddamn mess. That poor kid. Who chose this life? He did. That's it up ahead. Four walls and a room. <clears throat> We're moving up in the world. You ain't seen inside it yet. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. You sure this place is empty? I ain't sure on nothing. All right. Oh, shit. The it's them again. Oh, shit. Damn it. Still some here. Yeah. I can see that. You think there's more of them? I'll oh. check the house. You keep watch out here. Oh, he did. Anymore, you upstairs. I'm coming for you. You hear me? Where are you going, man? Come out where I can shoot you. Are you dead? He dead. Alright, is anybody in this room? I knew you'd come soon enough. Yeah? You are some of the coward. Yeah, you got a big ass like beard. You. Bounty hunters, the freedmen, oh, yeah. carpet beggars. <clears throat> Start loading your gun. Army of criminals who stole our land and our government. I survived them all. Our fight will live on. Jesus. Oh, damn! All right, John. They did. I think that's a lie. There you go. Yeah. 
Here they come. Welcome home. Home, home, home. To uh, my humble abode. We got fine living. Nor the corpses and the alligators. It's paradise. I love it. Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly work your magic? Arthur, take a ride with me. Where are we going? Come on. George? Yes? Could I have a word with you? <clears throat> Not now. Come on, Arthur. Oh, come on. Can you believe that, girl? All I've got going on, and she wants to talk. Everything okay with you two? I got far more important things to worry about right now than Molly O'Shea. So, where are we going? To take a look at this eighth wonder of the civilized world, San Denis, I keep hearing about. According to the map, the road up... Huh? Uh -huh. The road up this way should lead us right in there. All right. I guess this day ain't over yet. Not quite. Good work back there, Arthur. Everything went okay? Few loose ends. Nothing major. Don't you be. About what you'd expect. He's taking it hard. We are going to get that boy back. Whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city for Bronte. So, yeah, the way. of course, public places, <clears throat> maybe start with the saloons. Anyone who can put us in contact with him. Of course. What about the Pinkertons? I'm fairly sure nobody followed us. We moved out fast. We should be safe for a few days here. And then? I think we need to move a little further. Put some ocean between us and all of this. Damn. The mess with those two families. Losing Sean. I see things differently now. For a long time, I truly believed a paradise lay somewhere in the West for us. But I just don't know anymore hmm. so we're leaving the country now maybe i'm still thinking about it whatever we do we'll need more money okay there she is and the name the real city <clears throat> the future <sighs> big cities they're always repellent Exactly. I'll find you in there. Go see what you can figure out. Yes. Hmm. Chapter four. Alright everybody, that's all for this video, so tune in next time and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace I'm out of here.